So the topic name is uh, FSR File Server Resource Manager. So let's say in my server I have a shared folder. Let me create one. I think I don't have any shade folder. Okay, let me create one shade folder. Um, let's say tops. And I'm sharing this folder. I'm in default sharing. I share, I share, I share this folder. And then giving full permission so that everyone can access it. Okay, so this folder. Actually, I saved this folder in the, the drive E. So the capacity of the drive is 19.4. Okay. So I'm connecting the server. So I can see the dock and right click on the dock and magnetic drive. And finish. Uh, you can see that. Uh, it's around 19.4 in the capacity of the shared folder so that I can store or from this user I can store around the 19.4 GB of data. Imagine uh, not just one person is using this shared folder, many are using it. So I want to set up a quota for each user. Let's say for every user I'm just giving a, a 1 GB of space instead of uh, the whole space of the uh, partition. Okay. So how can we do that? So in that case we need to install the FSRM on the server because uh, my shared folder is in this uh, uh, server. So let me go to the server manager. I add roles and features and then uh, choose the file server resource manager. Under files and storage services, the roles. And uh, there you can find the file server resource manager and install it. Okay, the installation is over. So I have a tool uh, available, uh, file server resource manager tool. Uh, there you can find quota management. Okay, so in quota management, uh, there is quota. Right now, there is no quota is running, and a few quota templates are available. Those quota templates are having 10 GB limit, 100 MB limit, like that. 2 GB. I can use this uh, 2 GB. Or if you want, you can customize by creating a new quota by giving a name and choose the one you want to copy, or just you can, can simply give you a requirements like 1 GB. Okay. So in this case, I'm just going to use this 2 GB limit. Okay. And uh, I have, and uh, it is hard quota and hard and soft. Hard means once the user reached his uh, quota. He won't be able to write more data. And if it is soft, uh, still he can access the space even even though it, he reached the maximum. Uh, but the administrator received an email. If it is connected to a mail server, he get he continue get an email so that he get to know this user is having. Uh, I mean, cross the limit. Okay. So I'm going to go with the two GB hard limit. 
so I'm, I want to choose this template so for that uh, create a quota okay go to quotas right click create quota and the path the path is going to be my shared folder so here this is my folder docs and then uh, I need to choose the template from this list uh, template let, yeah 2 GB limit and here you can see it's a hard quota and create it yes and uh, now it's created for every user so let me try to refresh it now you can see this user now will get only 2 GB of space you cannot configure you cannot copy more than 2 GB of data if you try you can uh, copy up to 2 GB of space that is the uh, quota management one more tool is available that is called the file screening that means if a user got this uh, 2 GB space he can copy any type of data like the documents video audio PDFs whatever other types suppose if you want to restrict some file formats you can do it for example I don't want to uh, copy or the administrator or the according to the company policy no one need to copy a picture into this drive okay so let me choose one file screen so here you can see at templates here also you can find the templates these templates are created like audio and video like that image files block image files let me look at the image files list uh, there you can find image files what actually the meaning of image files if you click at it you can see these extensions are categorized as the image files jpeg is there png is there yeah png is not there so yeah png is there so main major file formats i mean the uh, image file formats are already there so i'm going to block this so uh, go to file screen right click create file screen and choose the path here also i'm using this path uh, docs and then block images create now you won't be able to copy any image okay so let's see so for that i need an image file so i have an image file in my in my drive so i have a disk available here so i have a picture this picture is actually jpeg picture and this is actually the picture okay so what i'm going to do i'm trying to copy this one into the particular shade folder so copy and then go to this doc and right click and paste he's saying that you need permission to perform this action that means you are not allowed so these are the quota management and the file screening. 